how many hours a day should I study for my math classes? Years ago, the recommendation was five hours for every one credit hour of class. So most college classes, at least in the US, are three credit hours. So that would be about 15 hours a week per class. That was the recommendation back then. Over the years, they changed the recommendation to about four hours. And when I was in college, I'm pretty sure the recommendation was about three hours. So they would say, yeah, three hours for every one credit hour. So for a three credit hour class, about nine hours. That's the guideline I used when I was in college. And it was pretty good. Sometimes I would have to study more. Now they just tell people, hey, you know, study as much as you need to. That's what I tell people. But the real answer is, you need to study as much as it takes in order to guarantee your success. You have to push yourself. And when I mean push yourself, I mean you need to push. You need to push hard. You can't give up. If you have to go to bed and you have to wake up at four in the morning to do homework, to be ready for that test, you need to do it. If you need to study extra hard, make that sacrifice. Think about what it means to you. That's really what it comes down to. If you're taking a class and you want to get a good grade, just think about how important it is to you. Most of the time, it's probably more important than you think. This is the one time in your life that you're in college. Like, this is it. You know, in 20 years, you will not be taking a class, whether it's college or high school. 20 years from now, you will be doing something else. This will be your past in 20 years. And let me ask you this, do you wanna have regrets? You don't wanna have regrets. That's why you need to push yourself. That's how I was always able to study so much. I would tell myself that in 20 years, I would not be in this class. I would not be studying these logarithms or these derivatives or these integrals or writing these proofs. I would be somewhere else in 20 years and I would be looking back and asking myself, why didn't I study more? And you know what? I have no regrets. Why? Because I pushed myself. If you push yourself, you will succeed and you will eliminate regrets from your 20-year future self. Go out there and push yourself right now.